Hi, my name is Jack Plummer and I'm with Columbus Fifth Wheel. And today I'll be doing a walk around on the Columbus 366 RL. The first thing I want to point out is our front cap. Our front cap is an automotive style paint scheme with two coats of clear coat. The advantage to our customer is over time this unit's not going to fade. So we spent a little bit more money on our front cap and also I want to point out our graphics. Our graphics are a, a graphic by Vermella that has a five year warranty from peeling, fading, and cracking. So the advantage to you is over time, when you buy, purchase this unit, in two or three years, it's not gonna look outdated like it's 15, 20 years. If you go to any RV dealer and look down their used lot, you can tell the units that skip a little bit of money, spend, save money on their graphics by the way they fade and they peel and the crack. Also, I wanna talk about the optional More Ride pin box going to give you a nice smooth ride and avoid all that chucking from your starting and stopping. And Columbus also offers the slam latch baggage doors with, with the magnet holds that you put up, holds together, so you, when you're reaching in, putting your belongings underneath, you don't have to hold your door up with one hand or like on the struts where they sit here you have to bend down and try to fit everything up. It completely gets out of the way. You have complete access to your underbelly and putting your belongings away. Columbus also gives you the full glass entry door with the shade here that will protect you from any sunlight along with the screen. This is an awesome feature. We give you the more ride step above. Strut assist, it tucks away, out of the way. And it's very light. So if it slips out of your hand and it comes crashing down, it's not gonna come barreling down on top of you. So it sits down to the ground, it's very sturdy. It's rated at 550 pounds. And more importantly, Animals love it. So if you have that dog or a cat that loves to go in and out of the unit, it's going to be a nice steady step for them. Here at Columbus, we're the only ones that use the TST monitoring system. What this is, it's a tire monitoring system that tells you how inflated your tires are. So it's going to tell you your tire pressure and it's going to tell you the heat of your tires. So as you're traveling down the road, if you start to lose tire pressure, you're going to have a device, it looks like a little GPS system that goes in the bed of your truck that tells you the tire pressure of all four tires. This is going to help prevent any blowouts because what happens is you're traveling down the freeway, your tires is a little underflated and as you're going down, well your tire starts to expand. But when it ex expands, it really starts to heat up. And that's when your tire, you have tire issues. With a tire monitoring system, what that's gonna do is going to alert you before it gets too hot and you have that blowout. So when we have the blowout, it ruins the uh, wheel well, fender, and your tire. So this is telling you, hey sir, time to pull over, let's check your tire. The 366 comes standard with an outside kitchen. We were one of the first uh, companies in the industry that started giving you outside kitchens without bunks. You know, we listened to our customers. There were so many people out there that said, hey, I bought my bunk house and my outside kitchen five or six years ago and we love it, but the kids have grown, they've moved out, and we don't want to sacrifice our outside kitchen, but we no longer need the bunk. Nobody else is making that out there. So Columbus, a few years ago, decided to make a few couples coaches with an outside kitchen. We also have the optional storage rack. A lot of people would call this a bike rack, but it's much, much more. This bike rack, or this storage rack, is rated at 450 pounds. So not only can you put bikes on there, you can put totes, you put firewood, you can put a portable generator if you need to. So this is very sturdy, it's attached to the frame, and like I said, it's rated at 450 pounds. All Columbuses are a 50 amp service, so you have the 50 amp cord. Nice thing with that is you can run both ACs if you're hooked up to 50 amp, and you can run a lot of th features inside the coach. One thing I want to point out, this unit has the residential refrigerator. So at Columbus, we don't act like we know everything. 
we listen to our customers and we had a customer that really liked their residential refrigerator but had an issue with the compressor. What they had to do is they had to pull their refrigerator out into the living space. They tore up his floor and broke his island. He said, why, why don't you guys just put a little access door back here so we can access it if something goes wrong? And that's what Columbus has done. If anything was to go wrong with this residential refrigerator, you have an access panel that can get to the um, compressor. Also, you have access to your ice maker valve. So if you need to shut that off, instead of getting down, pulling out a drawer and reaching back there, you have the uh, valves right here. This is our pass-through storage system. The Columbus has the uh, one-touch my control system, which will control your level up system, but we also have this panel outside. So if you want to do your level up system, you can do it outside um, the unit, so you can see your truck, or you can do it through the MyRV system inside. Or a third option is you can download it on your phone and download the app and you can control it from your phone. What I like about the one touch screen is if you have it on your phone, and let's say you get into a tight spot and you want to put this slide out out, you can be your own spotter. So you just hit the app, you put the slide out in and out, and you don't have to worry about your wife yelling saying, hey, too close, and you don't hear it, and you just keep going and you, you crunch it. Saying, why didn't you tell me? So you be your own spotter here. Also, this is an awesome feature that Columbus does. We spend a little bit more money in our construction of our slide out floors and the fascia behind our slide out rooms. We use a treated material, it's a blackboard material that will not absorb water. A lot of our competitors will use a structure board with a dark coat material, a plastic material with staples throughout. If moisture gets up in there, or if the staples come out because you're putting a slide out in and out, water's going to get up into that press board and it's just going to blow it up and it's going to rot your floor out. With this treated material, it's, going, it's not going to absorb water. We use that in our, on our floor and in our slide out room, or behind our fascia. Now let's go inside. Welcome inside the Columbus 366RL. As you can see, this unit here has an awesome island. This floor plan was designed with the new homes in, there, in mind. Because when you're building a new home, a lot of people will design the kitchen around the countertop. So if you look how large this countertop is, no one else has something like this. This is Columbus thinking outside the box. So we didn't just go look at another manufacturer and look at their floor plans. We looked at the new homes and what people are doing in new homes. So you see this has a large island, has a wine rack, and additional counter space over here, along with a prep sink. So with all this counter space, we give you an additional prep sink. This comes with an outside kitchen, so if you want to have um, a place to clean your vegetables, place to mix drinks and put ice back in here if you're using that as counter space, you have that option. It also comes with a Lazy Susan. You're not going to find this in many floor plans in the RV industry. You'll find that in new homes. That's something we've incorporated into this floor plan. Also, the residential refrigerator. As I spoke about outside, it's a 20 cubic foot refrigerator with an ice maker. If you have to shut your ice maker off, you just go on to the outside, you just reach in there and you shut it off. You're not getting on your knees reaching behind a, a, a cabinet trying to figure out where it is and shut it down. One thing I want to point out about Columbus is we're 101 inches wide. Most of our competitors are 96 inches. So we're giving you five more inches of interior living space. But we go f much deeper than that. If you look through here, look at, we use 30 to 40% more lighting. We 
we also give you more air conditioning ducts. So with our units, we use the Coleman 15,000 Serenity AC, which has the H duct system. We've tested all the systems out there, and there's a lot of claims out there that they have the best, but we've actually done the test, and with the H duct system and all the vents that we give you, with the Coleman AC, it puts out more CFM into your unit. All right. On our on our roof, we also use a an attic fan that will take the hot air into in the roof and blow it out. So this unit's not going to be as hot as some of our competitors. So your AC doesn't have to work as hard to cool down. Nice feature I want to point out is the optional hybrid carpet. So essentially it's no carpet at all. We came out with this. We have a high-end product which is called our 1492 package. We've had a lot of customers ask, hey I bought my Columbus in 2012, 2013. I'm ready to trade up and I want some nicer features like a power reel cord, upgraded graphics, um, a list of 24 items. Well, One of those items was the hybrid carpet. It was so successful out there in the uh, show season that we had a lot of people ask, hey, I don't, have, I, can't, I don't really want the 1492 package or it's out of my price point, but I really like the hybrid carpet in the unit. Can I get that in a Compass price point or a regular Columbus? And at first we were like, ah, no, that's only in the 1492 package. But then we got together as a sales team and said, are we missing sales? A lot of customers are asking for this. So we decided to make it an option um, on all four of our lines. So this is the hybrid carpet. There's zero carpet throughout this whole unit, okay? And with our outside kitchen, inside we give you fantastic storage. This is behind the television. You, can put a, you have all the additional storage back here because if you think about it, our outside kitchen's behind here. This would be wasted space in a lot of other of our competitors. However, we've utilized this space for additional storage. Not only do you have the storage back there, but you have the full pantry. One thing at Columbus that we've done this year is with the trifold sofa, we've, we've heard they're really cool, they're neat, but one, they're a little heavy, and two, if I'm sitting down here lounging in my chair, and you want to put the grandbaby to bed or you want to pull off the sofa this person kicked up in their chair nice and relaxed watching the game is going to have to put their feet back so we got with our supplier and said how do we resolve this and they came up with this solution Trifold sofa. So for you customers that that's a little heavy to fight with, this is very light. This person can st still sit back and enjoy the game with their feet up. And when it is time to call it a night, you can put both sides out. See how light that was? and give you a nice sleeping area. At Columbus, we listen to the campers, and one of the complaints when this the Columbus was being designed is, why do manufacturers spend so little amount of money on the drawers? Because as campers, we're constantly opening and closing the drawers. What most competitors do is they use a 90 degree angle with four or five staples in. Over time, they're eventually gonna pull apart. But what Columbus does is we use a dovetail construction drawer, that's reinforced at the bottom. It gives you a nice strong drawer that's not going to fall apart in your hand as you're operating it, moving it in and out. We have a 60 by 30 shower. Even for big guys like me, I'm not cramped. Most of our competitors have a 48 by 30 shower. So I'd be sitting here, my shoulders would be hidden, I'd be trying to shower here. 
there's a 60 by 30 gives me space if I want to sit down I have that option or if you're a taller person we have the skylight so with our shower in the Columbus it gives you plenty of space also we give you a deep bathroom sink it's not one of those little bitty bowls that when you're trying to shave everything's coming off to the side or that Vespa bowl that's up here I admit that kind of looks cool but that would drive my wife nuts because like most men I'm not when I shave I'm not gonna clean out the bowl so when our guests come over we're gonna see how dirty it is or my toothpaste something along that lines so this is a nice bowl nice deep porcelain bowl you can just clean it out here we are in the Columbus bedroom as you can see being 101 inches wide it gives you a lot of space in here we also give you larger windows to let in natural light this bed this option has the optional king bed it comes standard with the queen bed This has the memory foam mattress. Outlets on each side of the bed. And the reason we have outlets on each side of the bed is for those campers that have CPAP machines or have to charge your cell phone at night. You see above our windows, on each side we have a CPAP machine. Place to put it, place to plug it in. That's from campers feedback. This is also a great feature that we give you. Our bed is framed in aluminum with struts. A lot of our competitors will save money by just putting wood frame bed. Eventually those struts are going to fall apart or they're going to pull out of that wood and you're not going to be able to access all the storage underneath your bed. All Columbus's home washer dryer prep. This one happens to have the optional stackable washer dryer. And then inside our closet, you have a hanging rack, shoe rack, plenty of space. 